Hello everyone, it's me Ross. Before two days, Apple released their new iOS 16 with all the new goodies and improvements available for all the supported devices. And everyone is asking, how can I install this iOS 16 on my supported iPhone device? And you know what? It's easy. Today I will show you how. Alright guys, this is my iPhone 13 and you can see I'm using the latest version of iOS 16. You can see the new lock screen. Let's hold our finger and you can see we have all the customizations here. You can change your wallpaper, you can change your clock, your widgets and everything. But this is something which I will explain in another video. Very useful, very good new lock screen and all the new features coming with this iOS 16. But today we are here for something else. Let's just swipe, open our device. I will just go in settings and scroll down just to show you which version I am using. About and you can see I am using iOS 16. And guys, what's the biggest problem? This update for now is available only for Apple developers. This is a beta, developer beta. And how you can use it? just by become an Apple developer, but this future is paid. That's why today I will show you how you can make it easily without paying anything. All right, as we can see, I'm using this iOS version 16 and let's just go through the steps and show you how you can install it on your Apple supported device. Just open Safari. It needs to be Safari, guys, remember that. If you are using other browser, it won't work. You need to use Safari. Open that website, betaprofiles.com. You can see it, of course, it will be in video description. But when you open that website, just scroll down a little bit. And what we have here, iOS beta profile. iOS 16.0 beta 1. This is for iPhones, of course, if you are using an iPad and you can also download iPadOS beta profile. And of course, if you are using Apple Watch, you can download WatchOS 9. And this version is equal to iOS 16. And of course, you can download this profile and install latest WatchOS on your Apple Watch. You also can download tvOS 16 and everything that Apple is supported and you can use the latest goodies on your Apple device. So I have only an Apple iPhone. That's why I will just show you how you can do this. So when you are here at that website, just scroll down until you see this install profile. Just tap on it. And this is just a disclaimer. You can read it. By downloading and installing this profile, you are enrolled in Apple's developer beta program. The updates, the updates that you receive after installing this profile are called developer beta. So it will include bugs and other problems for your device. Apple will usually fix these bugs in the next version. Make sure you know what you are doing with your device. Don't forget to backup your iPhone and check the FAQ page before installing this. So guys, just to sum it up, you will become an Apple developer and you will receive, and you will receive first all beta releases, developer beta. This is a pre-beta release before public beta on your Apple device. So keep in mind that this is not a stable version and you can have some bugs using this developer beta. This is very important because if your Apple iPhone is your daily driver, maybe it's not a good decision to install this beta profile. Anyway, when you are familiar with everything like this and something important guys, if you want to leave that developer beta, you can just uninstall your profile and just leave your iPhone like this. When public releases are equal to your developer beta, you will start to receive a public releases. That's it. So when you are ready and know everything, just install this, install anyways, tap on it. This website is trying to download a configuration profile. Do you want to allow this? Just tap on allow and you can see that message profile downloaded. 
review the profile in settings app if you want to install it so just close here guys for me it will be a little bit different because i'm already a developer and i already installed ios 16 but i want just to let you know so tap in settings and you can see under your account you will see that profile download just tap on it and you can see ios beta software profile apple care profile signed certificate and you can see it's verified and description is configures your ios device to use with the apple beta software program and that's it you can tap on here on more details and read everything that you want to know but if you want to go further just tap here on the upper right corner and select install of course enter your password read that message from apple and just select install install and your device needs to be restarted let's tap restart and leave it for a minute so my device is already restarted let's open it and now if you want to check this profile is already installed just go in settings scroll down select general scroll down select vpn and device management and here you will see your configuration profile ios 16 beta software profile you can see it's here it's installed after you are ready with all the beta software and you want to remove it just select remove profile your phone will be restarted as and as already mentioned you will start receiving just the regular public releases when your current release is equal to public releases so that's it we are ready here and if you want just to install ios 16 just go back select software update Wait it for a minute and your update will be here. Select install and that's it. You know the rest. I am already using iOS 16 and if you are interested in video what's new for iOS 16, just let me know down in the comments. That was the video for today. If this video helps you somehow, don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my videos. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.